Good morning, everybody. <clears throat> Today we're flying the uh, tri motor, Ford tri motor, Victor Hotel, and we're getting fueled up on this foggy morning. A little bit of thunder cloud going on out there. But it's supposed to clear off here pretty soon, so we'll wait just a little bit and see if we can't get out of here and head southbound. Well, it looks like it's cleared up a little bit. I think we can go ahead and fly south. We're going to head down to Auburn, Maine. It's not too far from here. And uh, take in the scenery. Let's go ahead and get her fired up. All right, we got good starts all the way around. And we're going to take a good look at our pressures, temperatures, electrical, and fuel. Everything looks good. The lights are on. We've got good right. Good left, pull in, pull out, right and left pedals, looking good. Let's go ahead and taxi up to the, uh, to the active. Take the brakes off. slightly to the right by the way so we can make a good turn up here. We do not want to go off this edge, I'll tell you. So we're lined up runway 12. Let's take a look at our map. So we're going to head right down here to Auburn Lewiston Municipal and Auburn Lewiston Maine. So we're going to have a little bit of a, a right turn after takeoff. Let's go ahead and do it. Kind of a narrow runway here. Try 
try to keep her on here. On the pavement. And let's rotate. And she's up. Wagon, Victor Hotel minus one is type one miles east of Tree Bravo five nine hundred feet. Request flight following. Wagon Victor Hotel minus one Portland approach. Squawk two seven three four. Squawk two seven three four wagon Victor Hotel minus one. Wagon Victor Hotel minus one radar contact one mile southeast of Tree Bravo five one thousand two hundred feet. Altimeter. Roger Wagon Victor Hotel minus one. There we go. We'll start trimming her out just a little bit. She needs a lot of work trimming. Constantly making trims on this girl. But that's okay. And today we have one of the uh, Pico female flight officers on board with us today. Uh, got a little update from them recently. Not quite sure what they did, but uh, I guess they've made some kind of changes. I really didn't read any release information on it. So we got this pond kind of right in front of us. We're going to scoot right over the uh, left edge of it. And the airport's not too far beyond the, uh, beyond the lake. Let's see if we have anybody close by. Doesn't look like it. Quite a few planes up, but they're out there pretty far. So the trend motor flies really nice. I mean, you do have to stay with trimming, and uh, but it handles really nice. It's smooth. It's got plenty of power. You get up to altitude, you could push the uh, you could push the power pretty good on this girl. She'll get up to speed on you pretty quick. So. Yeah, she's got she's got lots of power. But on this flight, such a short flight, we're gonna stay low and keep our, our power down just a little bit. So we got a little river coming up here. Once we hit that river. We should be uh, seeing that airport. What a beautiful airplane. And she sounds good too. So there's our runway.
We'll go ahead and give them a call. See what they're using today. Well, I guess we can select what we want. Let's go ahead and use runway 22. Kilo Lima Echo Whiskey, traffic wagon Victor Hotel minus one two miles northeast 2,000 feet inbound to land runway 22. And what we'll do is we'll just do a nice 360 here. Lose a little bit of altitude and we'll go right straight into 22. Again, flies very smooth, very gentle. You don't want to get too far ahead on your banking because uh, to get it back on straight level flight, you're really going to have to bank her around hard to, to get that turn. So you make your turns pretty gentle on this girl. So when we first had the, the plane out, <clears throat> the uh, weather wasn't <clears throat> all that great. Had some fog, low clouds, kind of stormy looking. And we kind of waved it out and look what we got here. We got some pretty decent weather. So this turn here, let's see if we can get a good eyeball on, eyeball on the runway, runway 2-2. Two two. There she is. Nice, easy approach. Again, you want to use quite a bit of trim on your landing. <clears throat> Try to keep that, uh, keep your yoke uh, from being overworked. So I'm dialing in a little bit of nose down trim. Nice little airport. So we just pulled the power all the way back. And we'll bleed some of the speed off right in here. That was a little rough, but I think we're good. Let's bring that tail well all the way back. So we'll back taxi on the grass here. I don't see any traffic around, so I think we're good. Kilo Lima 
We're going to pull into the main terminal. There we go. So we'll set the brakes. <clears throat> we'll go ahead and open up the doors. <clears throat> and we'll have the uh, company truck come out and unload the baggage for us. And we'll shut this girl down. Off. You got one more light switch way up there in that corner, so you have to kind of move over to get to it, and then your battery and your alternator, and we are good to go. There's our baggage truck, and as you can see, the baggage bays have been opened up <clears throat> under the wing. And uh, makes it for uh, easy loading. I hope you enjoyed that flight. Talk to y'all later.